farmer finds his sheep killed, skinned, dismembered and entrails thrown up a tree. A sheep was found dismembered, skinned, chopped up and scattered in a field by its farmer owner who has called for the killer to be found. Evan Kelly, who runs a farm in County Offaly, Ireland, took photos of the gruesome scene in a bid to bring the person to justice. Sharing the photos on Facebook, he said, I apologize to those of you who may find these images disturbing but this only mildly depicts the reality of the scene that was encountered and the incident that took place. Between Saturday evening and Sunday morning there was an attack on our sheep which resulted in a ewe being brutally killed and butchered on the bank of the Grand Canal, adjacent to our farm just outside of Dendery, awfully. Regardless of the financial loss, it is shocking to think that someone believes this is an acceptable thing to do. Feel free to share. Mr. Kelly was alerted to the killing by a dog walker on his family farm and told the Offaly Express the killer had even thrown the ewe's entrails up a tree. He believes the way the sheep was found indicates a person was responsible for the killing. This wasn't a dog or anything, this was someone set out to do this, it was a shocking scene with blood everywhere and the guts and insides of the animal thrown high enough up into a tree, he said. Whoever did this caught the ewe for a start which is a task in itself, then there are marks where they dragged it through the wire and the drain, where the water would be up to your knees, and out onto the canal bank. The animal was properly skinned. He added, this wasn't just someone who did it on a whim, this was someone who's done it before and had proper equipment to carry it out. Mr. Kelly and his father have over 300 sheep on their farm and said it was impossible to fit the entire place with CCTV. Irish police are investigating the ewe's killing and anyone with information should phone a Dender Ray Garda station on 0469731290. More, airport parking customers come home from holiday to find cars covered in mud more, it's not just humans that are chatterboxes, animals have conversations too.